Hey guys, today we are back at Disney Springs and today we want to show you guys some of the Halloween offerings that they have here. Go to Gideon's, hang out, just have some fun, do some more shopping. So come on and join us. It is a Saturday here at Disney Springs and it's busy, but it's not too bad. The current wait for Gideon's is like a three hour wait. Luckily, I think we have someone on the inside. It's gonna help us out. All right, let's get moving. Let's head that way. This site never gets old. It's, you know, it can be cloudy, it can be partly cloudy. The water and the color of the water is always awesome. Really cool looking. There's Homecoming right there to the right. And Plant Hollywood. And there's Deluxe Burger right over there. Bridge is always really busy. It's hard to get pictures on there because so many people flowing, but it's pretty crazy. Here's the current line for Gideon's. It's a three hour wait virtual queue, but luckily we have a friend that may have gotten in early for us. I can't come to Disney Springs without checking out the orange bird, right? Gotta say hello to him. There's Boathouse right down there, which we're still gonna eat at, I promise, one day. But this is pretty cool. Okay, made it over here to Wonder Made Magical Marshmallows. Let's see what they got over here. Looks like they have some bougie, no, excuse me, boozy marshmallows. They have bourbon, fireball, pina colada, rose wine, stout beer, and strawberry champagne. That sounds awesome. Okay, and here's some more over here. We have s'mores and birthday cake and salted caramel, pumpkin and cookies and cream. Sounds awesome. Okay, so they ended up giving me a couple of samples here. We have salted caramel and they gave me birthday cake as well. You guys know me, you know I love birthday cake flavored stuff. So this is gonna be really interesting. I'm gonna try these out real quick. Okay, so here is the salted caramel. What's that? You can show me. Mmm. Okay. So, have you guys ever tried like the Turtle Track ice cream? That is exactly what it tastes like. It tastes exactly like that. It's it's delicious. Here is the birthday cake one. Let's see there. Look at that. Mmm. Now these are within my calories, <laughs> within my points. But this one looks good, it's got sprinkles on it. Who does not love sprinkles? Mmm, so good. But I will say it kind of, it's weird. Because it kind of has like a citrusy taste. Yeah, it's like, it's not true birthday, it's good. It has like a citrus taste. So if you like citrus birthday cakes, maybe that's the way to go. That's really good. I'll link all the information down below. You can come here, they run deals all the time. Uh, but this is really good. The staff is really kind and really sweet here. It's awesome. And they do have Florida flavors here too. Key lime pie, oh my goodness. We might have to try that. It's not right here. I thought it was down there. Maybe it's around here. Those are the boozy ones. And there's the gold champagne. Take a look at the deals they have. Buy three, get one free. Buy six, get three free. Uh, looks like the Rainforest Cafe is still building up its little volcano. They're working on it. It's been a couple of weeks now they've been working on it. So hopefully they'll get a little bit better. They were just like redoing it? Yeah, just a refurb, I believe. But that's it. Oh, that's Angie good. and I are just watching this bird down here. It's swimming. He pokes his head up again. Okay, on our way over here to Lego and World of Disney, but we're gonna stop at Uniqlo, which is like right over here. So let's head in there, see if they have any cool shirts. Oh, I love this store. It's so awesome. Have we ever shown this before that you can design your own t-shirt? Look at these shirts, the amazing Spider-Man and Venom. That is so cool. Oh yeah, here's a little bit closer here. 
is pretty sweet. It's awesome. This one is um, $24.90. Not bad. And the Venom shirt there too. It's pretty cool. Here's some of the shirt designs that you can do here. Different custom ones you can make. Like with Pinocchio or Jean right there. Oh, I like that Peter Pan one up there. That one It's pretty sweet. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. That's number eight on there. That one is pretty cool. They're running a sale on the Devil Hunter shirts. Look at that. That is pretty cool. And then they're also running a sale on the Chainsaw Devil shirt. $14.90 right now for that. It's a short sleeve. Then they have some shirts that are on sale for $5.90. Burger, she wrote. Pizza. Nista. That's pretty cool. All these are $5.90. There's a Mickey one down there too. This one is originally uh, $24.90 and it's actually $5.90 here. It's pretty cool. I love this thing. This thing is so cool. The line for Lego is pretty long today, so I don't think we're gonna go in there. All right, time to go into the world of Disney and we're gonna go through this entrance here. Woo! All right, here we go. So it looks like they have more of the same stuff, all the 100th anniversary uh, spirit jerseys, the ears, Mickey that was yet we showed last time. I want to show this again. This lounge fly, which is really awesome. It's really cool. I do love this. You know what? I just noticed all of these have characters on them. That's Tiana. That's pretty cool. I don't know if we showed this last time. This is cool. This is a long sleeve. That is pretty cool. I feel like I've seen it somewhere, but I haven't shown it anywhere. But this is pretty awesome. I love this. It goes all the way up to uh, 2X, which is cool. Price tag on that is, oh, it's only $39.99, so it's not as high as I thought it was. Take a look at this lounge fly. This one's pretty awesome. So some of the designs actually change on these. I mean, they're all like have the same characters, but see how this one has like blue in the left-hand corner here. You go up here, blue's a little further down, and there's Defiti there. Like, it's, it's really cool. This is awesome. I love this. Um, my stepdaughter had one that's just like this, but it was like the older characters, right? Or was the animals, I think? Cats. It was cats. Yeah, all the cats from Disney and stuff like that. Yeah. That is pretty cool, though, with the pockets there. That is pretty awesome. I love that. And um, this one is only $78, so not too bad. Look at this little Mickey character here. What is he doing? Oh, he has some popcorn. Oh, yeah, he's me. There, there's my Mickey edition. That's the one I need. If anybody wants to buy that for me, you are more than welcome to buy that for me. <laughs> that would be perfect for my office. Hey, look, he's even got the sunglasses, too. Look, that's awesome. And he's got popcorn? I mean, come on. Now, one could argue that this is an Icy and not a milkshake. It would be perfect Mickey John. There you go. This Pluto is really cool. He's got the 100th anniversary logo down here at the bottom, which is really cool. Of course, we've seen the Mickeys, and Angie says she needs the mini. We already have enough, babe. You've got one at home. <laughs> Take a look at this glass set. This is awesome, especially this one with Mickey and Spaceship Earth, or excuse me, Mickey and Space Mountain. I don't know why I got that confused. In the uh, Tiki Room, that's cool. Looks like Small World is behind that one. That is awesome. And then this one is, ah, it looks like Big Thunder. Then they have the plates here too, which is really, really cool. Oh yeah, that is Big Thunder. You can tell right there. That's neat. Ooh, I want this. Now, are they all different? Yeah, they're all different. So you get the four pack. So it's $34.99 for that. We do. It's probably something, though, that might come in the character warehouse a little bit later. But we will see. This cup is pretty cool. Looks like an icy should belong in that, right? It's got the little beads in the castle. $27.99 for that. And the ears are really cool here, too. That's awesome. Are you telling me you want these? Yeah, they do look good, don't they? 
Last time you had a Rice Krispie treat, though, you had a bad gallbladder attack. The dogs need a new dog collar. Oh, that's cool. How much is that? $19.99. $19.99, so not too bad. Well, they have some new Nightmare Before Christmas merch. Boogie Boogie. Oogie Boogie. And Jack. That is so cool. How much are these? Uh, $24.99 yeah. for these. That is so cool. I have not seen all of this. This is amazing. Look at that. Shirt there. And then look at this skull. Jack Skellington right here. Very close to uh, the popcorn bucket that we have at home, right? What is that exactly? It's a light. He lights up. No demo mode for him. It's not working, but this does light up, I assure you. And we have more shirts here. This one's cool. I like this one a lot. Actually, yes. We have the uh, hoodie here too, which is really cool. That is awesome. And just looking at the price on those. How much is that? $26.99. Then the hoodie is... The hoodie is $54.99 for that one. Zero that's lit up. That is awesome. $29.99 for him. That is really cool. I didn't know they had all this. I would have been here earlier to document all this. Yeah, this is cool. That is really, really awesome. Get him to stay up there. <laughs> Look at this countdown calendar. This is amazing. That is so cool. I would definitely want something like that. What's the price on that? $69.99 yep. for that. So not too bad. Oh, it's a diffuser. Oh, that's that's cool. Frog's breath diffuser. Yeah. That is really cool. Yeah. And the price on that one is... Vanna White, please. $59.99. $59.99. Deadly Nightshade. Oh, that's cool. cool. Oh, what do we got? Melts. Oh, really? That's awesome. Hot cocoa melts. That is awesome. How much is that? It doesn't say, does it? Nope. They want it to be a surprise. Let me see that a little bit better. You hold oh, it. Sorry. Yeah. That's okay. That is so cool. I love that. There are a few more items here. This is really awesome. This uh, water bottle here. And then look at this. This is so cool. That is awesome. I love it. I haven't seen these yet, but they have Oogie Boogie ears. This is so cool. I love that. Like frog's breath candy. They're like little gummies in here. It's cool. It doesn't have a price on that, but that's pretty cool. And then a zero plush. That is cool. $24.99 for this guy. So there's a lot of Halloween festivities that's going on out here at Disney Springs. We're going to see if it's going on out here in just a second because they have a lot of stuff but i just lost my wife <laughs> where did she go we're gonna head into the co-op real quick and take a look and see if there's anything new in here look at this hoodie walt disney's disneyland that's amazing and then the little mickey with the uh tv look at the mickey uh shoes that's really cool i love that now this is something that i need in my office that is pretty cool uh, and then this with Tinkerbell, which is amazing as well. Then we have the Disneyland shirts here, $39.99 for that. So cool. I think they've had that for a while now, but this is really cool. The Disneyland journal, oh, that's pretty sweet. It's a set of three. Oh, it is? Yeah. It's awesome. How much is that? It's heavy, huh? $29.99. It's heavy? What does that mean? It's expensive. It's expensive. Do you guys know what that's from? Leave it down in the comments if you know where that's from. If there's one thing about Angie that you should know, is that Angie is obsessed with... Blankets. Blankets. Whether they're fleece blankets, throw blankets. What's the type that you don't like? I can't remember what it's called. I don't know. I just want them soft. It's called what? I just want them soft. Oh, they have okay. to be soft.
Okay, so let's head to that Halloween stuff I was telling you guys about, and then we're gonna head over to Gideon's after that. There's a DJ on a pumpkin going around. I don't see them out right now. They might be soon. Here's a Goosebumps photo op here. That is pretty cool. Bippity Boppity Boutique over there. Disney Springs, source of inspiration. And this is where Rideshare will drop you off and pick you up right over here in this area. So if you're ever curious, it's way back here by Earl of Sandwich. You see on the map there. Well, you might be able to, it's a little dark. Decided to walk over here a little bit closer to the Rainforest Cafe and show you guys the scaffolding going on this way to the Lava Lounge. So they still are open, but it's getting some stuff done. It'll be cool when it's done. It's just gonna be a little refurb, probably paint, stuff like that. I don't think anything major. I didn't get over here fast enough, but you can see him back there. Look at him. Little boats, there they go. Here by the paddle fish. It would be kind of cool to eat up there one day. We'll have to do it someday. Okay, made it over here to Gideon's, getting ready for our virtual queue. We're gonna hop in this line, so probably about 20 minutes. Okay, here is a look at the new menu. This is a new bi-weekly, right? Correct? Every week? Uh, we are doing, in the month of October, October. we're doing this one a week. One a week. Look at this, we have the Frankenstein, the Bride of Frankenstein, the morning exclusive, evening exclusive. Hmm, what shall we get today? Oh, by the way, John is with us again today. Hey, everybody. And uh, he's just gonna give his professional opinion on on just what, about everything today. What am I today. doing? I give your professional this. opinion on everything I'm just today. gonna stare at my phone the whole time. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, so I think we're gonna try the bride. John is saying to try the bride. I hear there's a love, I remember where there's a lovely article on Pirates and Princesses about this from last year. All right. Because it's the same cookies last year, and it tastes the same. I like his tag. You know what, send that to me, and I'll link it down below for them to read. Oh, the smell when you walk in here. It's always so amazing and awesome. So good, man. Yeah, here is the one we were going after, the Bride of Frankenstein. Frankenstein looks amazing too, but I think we're gonna go for the Bride. This is white chocolate, you know? I tried the cakes before, and the cakes are delicious, aren't they? I think they're amazing. Just like you. But they are really good. Limited edition Frank cake there. We're not going to get that today. But John would be offended if I said it's, it's, good. it's too sweet. It's rich. <laughs> All right, here we go. The Bride of Frankenstein cookie. Look at this thing. Looks amazing. And we got the French toast cold brew on John's recommendation that this is rich. It's rich. It's rich. Don't get me in trouble. So here we go. Okay, so here we go. This is the Bride of Frankenstein cookie. It's a little crumbly. Look at John. He's gonna <laughs> eat some of the M&Ms off of here. It does have M&Ms. Now these are chocolate M&Ms, not to be confused with peanut butter M&Ms or peanut M&Ms, but here we go. So I'm not gonna lie, this is a delicious sugar cookie with M&M's. I mean, it's very rich. It's not too rich, but it's also sweet. John will appreciate that one. But yeah, the, uh, hear you. the little crumblies all over it, I could do without those. Whatever they're called, what are the official crumblies called, John? Crumbles. Crumbles? I think they're called white chocolate crumbles. I really think that's what they're called. I, I just didn't know if there was a gourmet name for them. Uh, no. Crumbles okay. are called crumbles. But, you know, popular you know, belief would, believe, it would have you think that each M&M tastes like it's a different flavor. <laughs> I'm just spitballing now. I'm trying to be professional in front of this professional food blogger over here, but... It's a good cookie. Would I wait in line for it again? Yes. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> Six out of ten. No, I'm just kidding. Eight out of ten. It's really good. So upon John's recommendation, or this is actually the one of the month, this is the French Toast Cold Brew. We're going to try this out and see how it tastes. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's really good. A lot of cinnamon, 
Of course, it's French toast. So you get that um, taste right away. Not too rich, not too sweet, just right. It's really good and refreshing. I wish I would have got the large one now, but this was the small one and it was around six bucks, somewhere around there. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's really good. And your standard WDW straw over here too. So I would definitely get it again. He would get it again. And see. I'm gonna come out here on what? November 1st with you too. Oh, you're coming out November 1st? I'm gonna be out here. I'll be here. All right, I'm really excited about what's gonna be the next cookie. I'm not telling you, that's I why know. you trust me. I know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say anything. I'm not gonna beg either. That's why I even know some other things I can't tell you. <laughs> now I'm really excited. Anyway, we'll see John again very soon. I'm so sorry, everybody. All right, guys, so that was our day out at Disney Springs. Had a lot of fun. Got to meet up with our friend John, got to try a new Gideon's cookie, which a new one's coming out in like just a couple of weeks anyway. And I am still polishing off my cold brew, which is so good. Angie, did you see anything in there today that you would like? No, not today. Not particularly because we all know we all want a bunch of stuff in there. So it is what it is. One thing you want? And they don't sell it. Hmm. Anyway, this is day 13 of 30 days of continuous content. We are starting to narrow down what our schedule is going to look like when we are done with the 30 days. We're enjoying this. We're almost halfway through. It's still going. And thank you guys so much for hopping on the live stream today. That hopped on the live stream. That was a lot of fun. And letting us know that you enjoyed the content. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. Hit that like button and the notification bell so you know when our next video is coming out. And remember, the road goes ever on. We will see you next time. Cheers.